first thing you, you got to notice, okay, I, I have the, the tape, the blade, it's up to the... Can you flip your piece of wood around so that the blade, like, put oh. it on, there you go. It's a secret. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, I'm, there you go. Yeah, but I kind of, wherever the high point, wherever the high tooth is, uh -huh. kind of make it, you know, where my pencil line is right there. Okay, and I also notice where this handle is on this, on the, on the crank to, to go up and down. Because if I tried to take that much material out going sideways on the blade, there's no way in the world it's going to happen. So you have to, like I say, I know that it's, well, let me back up. But I have, and I have to go this way. What are you sighting right there, Dennis? Okay, what I'm kind of sighting is, like I say, where this, where this cove is right here. Uh-huh. Okay, my... Oh, I see what you're saying, the front and the back of it? Yeah, yeah the you front and the back of it. Yeah, I'm yeah. trying to figure out the angle I have to put my... Straight up, you, know, you can't really see it, but I know that there's a flat spot on there. So I know that if I, if I'm a little bit away from the blade, about a quarter of an inch, I know my straight is is actually pretty close. At least I hope it is. Mind if I put a mark on the table? Yeah. <laughs> Only you, Jeff. You don't worry whether it's a 45 or the table or anything like that. You just eyeball it. I think it's because it's a unique game. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah, I just buy whatever the size of the arch that you want. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. All right. And I, I, I. We're gonna. I always use two boards, one on each side, and one between. Can I have it? That's it. That's twenty bucks a roll. <laughs> okay. Now, like I say, that two-sided tape. So you're not gonna clamp that. Nope. I Rich, don't that. stand where you're standing. <laughs> okay. Then, like I say, this. That's one. Just a little bit. A lot of times I do it two times. Why? Uh, just to clean it up a little bit. Do that with my plane, but the table saw does it a whole lot faster. And I can't see it, but so I'm going to do it this way. <laughs> like I say, everything I do, I just kind of eyeball it. that corner down and this corner down and that corner down to make it round. Thank <laughs> you. 
see that radius. It's still got some high, some high spots on it, but... That's pretty great. I'm going to get down and I usually start with about, with about uh, 50 grit. Well, yeah. Actually, it's pretty smooth. That's pretty awesome. I mean, you know, you can you can actually feel the mandangos more than you can see it. Don't ask me to define the that <laughs> <laughs> I'll make my template. And this design here too, there's there's so many different variations of this. Inside down and everything. You can feel you can feel the um, flat spots. If you, you know if you go up, there's probably one right there. You know, set down just a little bit more. But then.